In this video, we're going to use the list style shorthand property. And the list, house, list style shorthand property will help you in shorten basically the code that we have here. So, all right, so what, what is it really? Well, basically, it's straightforward. It's just list style. However, in here, you can put in multiple values. For example, you want to put in here a square. And then, or we can even remove the square. We want to use our nice image here. Now we say we want to put it on the inside. And if we do that, we can hide all of this text here, save this, go back here and refresh, and you can see it still works the same. Although you will not see much, so let's put this on the outside, and then you might spot the difference. If you refresh now, as you can see, there you are. So with the shorthand property or the list style shorthand property, you can just use lesser code. You can cover multiple lines of text into a single one, which is quite which is quite useful. And if you don't want anything at all, in our case, we just put in this, refresh, and there you are. It will just be this very straightforward, no extra codes. And this is the way how you can use the list list style shorthand property. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel and if you have any questions regarding this make sure you put them in the comment section i'll get back to you and if you enjoyed this video check out the next video here you will probably enjoy this as well